Hi, it's Randy from Tack Veins. I want to give you a quick overview of how to fletch Tack Veins with the Veinmaster Pro from Last Chance. Um, the Veinmaster Pro has got a lot of great features built in, uh, especially the repeatability to allow you to get the exact offset on that exact setup, uh, the knock depth, the, adjust the adjustments on this jig are awesome. Um, you know, just a couple things that are really help folks to, to fletch Tack Veins on there. Things to consider are one, our veins base they're extremely low profile. So there's not a lot of material that's gonna go between the wires and the shaft. So the biggest thing that we run into is getting enough pressure. Um, so as we do in our instructions, we, you're always gonna prime it, you're gonna glue it immediately after, and we're gonna stick it. So when you stick it for the first time, obviously you're gonna make sure that these edges are fully seated, but when you're actually fletching with it, I think the biggest, most important thing is that you squeeze the wires right up against the vein itself, right at the front edge and the back edge of the vein. That's gonna allow just a little bit of extra pressure to get that vein to fully seat. Uh, Sirenacrylite -like glue only cures on the absence of air. So if you got oxygen or air in underneath that base that it's not fully sealing, you're not gonna get a good bond. It's either not gonna stick at all or it's not gonna stick in a strong bond. Um, so this will really help to apply that extra pressure between the wires and the shaft itself and then I'll actually switch fingers and just press on the outside edge of the vein right here. So pressing on that outside edge of the vein is gonna make sure that that middle's totally seated as well. And when you remove the clamp, go ahead and stick your finger in there and hold the vein tight up against the shaft so that way it's not gonna possibly stick to the wires as well. Um, but that'll definitely help a lot is to add just a little bit more pressure to that jig is gonna be a big help. If you have any additional questions, you can uh, reach out via our website. We'll be glad to help uh, troubleshoot in any way we can.